Taking care of your family as a man isn't being a stay-at-home dad. Taking care of your family is providing financially. Well, as my friend Professor Neil would say, Here be with it. Picture this situation. Let's listen carefully and see who actually looks down upon a man who chooses to fulfill the role as the stay-at-home dad. You come home from a long day of work, you're stressed, and your man is at home, and he's got dinner on the stove for you, and he's wearing a little pink apron. Sounds like you're projecting your belittlement towards a man who's cooking for his wife, but I'm sure it's not belittling if the roles were reversed, right? And then he has to go and do the grocery shopping, so he has to ask you for the credit card. He does the cooking, then the grocery shopping? That's not in the right order. And then he jumps in your car to the shopping okay, center. As he intends intentionally left out the part where this man is attending to their children. What he is describing is a stay-at-home husband, which is a different thing. Imagine how Imagine. miserable he would be. Uh, he's miserable? Yes. He would pull over and scream. Did he unintentionally just showcase how a lot of stay-at-home mothers feel? If my husband is stay-at-home dad and I'm the breadwinner, my husband is set. But it's husband. your money, isn't yeah, it? Like we all know it's your money. Because when it's his money, it's fine because he's in control of it. And that's fine as long as you're taking care of my kids. Our kids. I don't know. Like that's like I think in practice you'd be pretty off it. Is he really trying to convince them or himself? A man who takes care of his family, is that not sexy? Taking care of your family as a man isn't being a stay-at-home dad. Taking it's care of your family is providing have. financially. All I see is a man who doesn't think highly of men who choose to be stay-at-home dads. And then is trying to convince women to feel the same way, to validate it. While son intentionally showcasing the experience of a lot of stay-at-home mothers. There are no rules and guidelines. Do what works best for you.